Hello and welcome to all of you all over the world. It is, of course, a fixture that needs no introduction. It is, without doubt, the ultimate game the continent has to give us, the final of Euro 2020. This competition has been one of change, one of many firsts. Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Jutta Football. No single host country, and I'm sure the debates about the success or otherwise of it will start as soon as the whistle has gone. Perhaps those debates already have, but one thing has never changed, and that is the fact that football keeps bringing us back for the very same reasons. These championships have again served the game well as a showcase for the best that it has to offer, perhaps helped in no small part by those changes which we have been witnessing. So let us hope it gets a fitting final. This, of course, a venue that needs no introduction. The iconic arch, a symbol of Wembley Stadium, the home of football. Well, that has got the juices flowing. And now this. Well, for the players on both sides, this is their date with destiny, a chance to ensure their place in football history. It is without doubt, Peter, the greatest show we have this summer. And the fact that this is like a celebratory edition too makes it that little bit more special, doesn't it? I've certainly enjoyed it, giving us a, a fair share of just about everything we've come to expect from a competition of this magnitude. And yes, let's hope that it gets the perfect send-off. They've got underway here pretty promptly. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Pavard. And it's played forward. And it's Fekir. Mbappe. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, that's where he wants it. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Mbappe! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. And it's been taken short. Lamar has a pop! Straight at the keeper. Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. He's through the middle. He gets past his man. Has a hit! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Portugal really have been deserted by their composure and allowed frustration to take over, and it's not a good sign. Has he found his man? Just brushed off the ball there. Mbappe! Mbappe has a shot! Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. Fakir goes up and over. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? And it's got through. Oh, great defending. That needed doing. Good run. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. 
Hernandez. Neither side yet able to find the net. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. It's a loose ball. William Carvalho plays it forward. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. There are a few waiting for it. A scything tackle. Forward it goes. And he's away. He's one on one. He's had a go. Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Mbappe just backs himself every time. Give him the challenge and he rises to it. Quick pull forward. Bernardo Silva. Oh, real danger here. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Goal! Portugal! That could turn out to be a big, big goal. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, certainly the big occasion and a very big opening goal to boost everyone's confidence here. Helps available out wide. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Guerrero. Up to meet it! No, oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. He simply mistimed the header and it was as if he knew it wasn't going to work out. Be a throw in. Oh, good challenge, stood up well against his man. In the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. Havar can't get the better of his opposite number. William Carvalho has given away a free kick. <laughs> Ruben Levers tries to get it forward quickly. Havar. Portugal are leading with half time drawing close. Hoists it forward. And it's Lamar. Big chance! And it's been taken straight back. Guerrero takes control of it and he's on the move. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! That had everyone off their seats. And that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter. And it's a pity it didn't cause the net to bulge. And it's played forward. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Attempt, just the wrong outcome. Mbappe certainly could have and should have made more of that. Lamar. It has gone for this one!
Bernardo Silva. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. And here we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It was very, very tight. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. Portugal leading 1-0 at the break. Already up and running for the second half. Portugal really need to go and, and grab another goal now, Peter, if they're going to go on and secure this. Tovan. Mondi. France can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. Hernandez. Hernandez goes looking. Mbappe. Bernardo Silva. That's not going to make it. Gets away from his opponents. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! A real chance and a real let off. Cristiano Ronaldo looked very impressive there. Well, at least until he got into a shooting position, something I'm sure he'd want to have a go at again. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. He's come loose. Toma! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Hernandez opts to play it back. Forward it goes. Well, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. And that is as far as they're going to go. Ruben Diaz plays it forward. Hernandez gets into a dangerous position. Tovan. There's a long ball. Ball in, just miscalculated. So we've reached the hour mark. Your impression so far, Jim? I think the manager's pondering his options as to whether to stick or twist Peter in view of, of the time remaining. He might have a, a tough call to make now. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Sidibe tries to get it forward quickly. France are definitely going about this the right way. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Titi drives it forward. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. France have it back and they can go again. And Titi. Hardly anything between the sides. Tries a shot! Oh, that is rather wayward. France making another change here. Titi, France uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Oh, good interception. Ruben Neves goes looking. Forward it goes. He 
Has found his man. Bernardo Silva. And Bernardo Silva! Bernardo Silva clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. It's over the line, and that'll be a goal kick. Back to the keeper, and go again. Ruben Neves does well to read it and intercepts. Guerrero. Guerrero going full tilt down the left. He's got options out wide. Real chance! Oh, and that should have been two. Oh, and a real chance to... City Bay plays it forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. And it's Lamar. France are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Well, well played, he saw that coming. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Titi tries to get it forward quickly. Well, this lead is tight, but it does look as though it may see them through. Just a few moments from glory. Forward it goes. Both sides a bit too casual in possession. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. All the way back, and they start again. Portugal need to hold on for a few more moments. Lamar plays a clever pass. Mbappe! Mbappe has a shot! That's a decent ball. And he's on his way! And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Portugal can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And now the breakaway. He's through, has a hit. There's a goal. They have stolen level at the last. France are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter attacking heaven. For a change in personnel. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. So all square with almost no time remaining. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Nothing to separate them, we have extra... The whistle goes, we're off and running. Portugal receiving an equaliser late on. Now they have to do it all again. Do they have what it takes? Rafa Silva looks to get on the end of this. He spotted the run and played him through. And he's there to cut it out. Hoists it forward, and it's played forward. Mbappe, he's through, now is he in? Breaks on here. Gonzalo Guedes, has he picked him out? Oh, that's nice. Titi goes looking. Now a chance to break. Mbappe. Oh, he's broken through. He's had a shot. 
And that would have been some goal. He's the one player you want on the ball running at defences, and that's precisely why. Forward it goes. Bruno Fernandes. Ronaldo provides an outlet. The referee has given a corner. That's not going far. Bruno Fernandes. Hoists it forward. Ronaldo looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. Attempts to play it through. Hits one! No, he couldn't find the finish. Rafa Silva has delivered a really costly miss. It could have been their last chance to win it. And he just whacks it away. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Well, if he's serious about trying from this range, I think he, he must feel he can generate the power. Big ask. Hernandez plays it forward, and it's Lamar. Half-time, extra time. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. And if you're just back, the action is back on the way already. So time for a bit of smash and grab. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Semedo tries to get it forward quickly, and it's played forward. Lamar flings it across. Tries to get it forward quickly. Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva tries running with the ball at his feet. He's left his man. Bernardo Silva! And the defence can get it clear. Has he found his man? Mbappe. Big chance. Mbappe! Goal at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. Solo Guedes, well positioned to make that interception. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And Titi, Titi drives it forward. And it's Griezmann! And that wasn't far away. Griezmann almost put a side ahead with a, a pretty fierce attempt. He really spanked that. Bernardo Silva, decent looking ball, looking to force his way through. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Any better luck this time round? Mbappe has a shot! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Really is now or never. They need a goal, however it comes. In with a header! And he's there to make a great save. 
The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Great leap! Could fall kindly. Oh, that's incredible! And that may just do it! Maurice reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Oh, that's great awareness. Full marks to him as he was just that bit quicker than everyone else on the follow-up. Portugal take the lead now. It's just a question of holding on I think it's just about seeing the rest of the game out now because the crowd have gone into party mode already And time is up Portugal celebrate they are the continent's ultimate team winners of the European Championship What a moment this is for all connected with the team it's a day for pride, a day for glory, another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.